how did I make my epic starting video? Um, I'll actually show you. Hang on a sec. There is a website that I went to. Um, let me just get it up for this. It was the better one? I think. Yes, this was it. Okay. Let me get it on screen for you. Mm, browser. Yeah. So this was the the website called placeit.net i'll even type it in the chat it's called placeit.net and there's a bunch of different uh designs and stuff that is free and you can do a free download fully um i do recommend if you do use it try to convert it to an mp4 file so that it makes it smaller and uh it basically like uh runs it smoother because to get it like this, it's like a 27 meg file. Um, but when you put it as an MP4, you convert it to an MP4, it changes it to like 4 megs or something like that. Blueberry193, thank you for following. How are you doing? Welcome. Hope you guys enjoy that website. Uh, we're not sponsored by that website or by Raid Shadow Legends yet, but maybe one day. <laughs> so anyway, last stream... We had gotten Eula. I have no music. Why? Why is everything dead silent? That's why. Um. So yeah, we pulled Eula last time, and um. Well, something funny happened. <laughs> uh, by funny I mean, ugh, I did I did not expect this whatsoever. Um. So we pulled Eula, and uh, we managed to get her weapon. <laughs> Remember when I said I wasn't going to pull for a weapon? So this is the new weapon. We're not going to be wishing for this weapon. Because God knows I don't have the patience or the money for that. Um, this... And yeah, I, I decided to pull for the weapon and... Now we got the weapon! We have it, which is cool. I'm actually really excited for this update. I'm not even joking. I'm so excited for this update. We collect the, the treasure chest already. So first things first... We're getting skins. We're actually getting skins. We're getting the jean skin and we're getting a barber skin. I believe everyone's going to get the barber skin for free. And then the jean skin is going to be like a discount for a limited time. You know, your boy's probably going to be getting that. I don't have jean. Another disclaimer. Excuse me. Another disclaimer. I don't have jean. But if we do get her, we'll already have the skin for her. Barbara, I don't use her, but I might build her after I get the skin. I don't know. Weapon-wise, I'm not wishing for another 5-star weapon. I'm not. I'm not wishing for another 5-star weapon. Do you hear me? I'm not wishing for another 5-star weapon. I refuse to wish for another 5-star weapon. Because that last 5-star weapon that I just pulled, I wasn't even expecting it. That was at, like, I think 70 pulls, which is soft pity. But I'm not going... I'm not getting to pity again. Within the next time, or the next 5-star weapon, I refuse to, and I'm not going to. Maybe. I'm probably going to wish for that weapon, if we're being completely honest. Um, This weapon, we're getting for free, which is dope, for Klee, which is Pog, because I already have Klee. So, I gotta rebuild my Klee now. <sighs> Which is gonna actually be kinda... You mm, know what I mean? And then, uh, this new weapon. Which is, by the way... This is the bow for Fischl from Honkai Impact, the crossover. This is actually that weapon. So, I'm curious to see what stats this weapon has. It's, pro it's probably gonna have attack. But, I don't know. I'm really curious, actually, for this. Because this is the weapon I'm most looking forward to. Um, because on Klee, I have a Witsith right now. So it's not, like, a specific weapon for her. This is a specific weapon for Klee. So I'm really curious as to what the substat is. And then we've obviously got, you know, this, these are all the new events. I'm not really going to go over those because I'm going to be doing a stream when the update comes out. And then this guy, who I'm also excited for, is the new boss. Magu Kenki. Sounds like a strong Japanese enemy. Magu Genki. And he, he looks like Zhao. 
well, he has the mask, kind of like Zhao. So I'm really curious to see like the storyline behind him. Also, he looks like he has some really strong attacks, and I cannot wait to kick his ass in like five hits because I have some overpowered characters like Hu Tao, and I now have Eula. The game is running like ass, and I have no clue why. So I'm just gonna drop the anti-aliasing slightly. You know, I honestly thought I would be taking a break today. I, uh, I didn't stream today. I didn't edit anything today. I didn't record today. Nothing like that. I thought I was going to be having a nice break. A nice time to myself. But MiHoYo has decided otherwise. MiHoYo has decided now out of the blue to uh, give us content. I need to log in. Hold up. So, obviously we know Mihoyo and Genshin Impact has been having their issues with uh, leaks. And as of such, they've been getting to the point where they've started suing people and like banning channels and stuff like that uh, over leaks. Um, And I thought now, like, I should probably update something on my youtube probably like you know edit together a youtube video so i grabbed last thursday's stream of genshin impact and i got to the point of where i started talking about uh the 1.6 update like the event and the new boss magu kenki and uh the skins and the weapons that's coming along and um well then then i got a notification on my phone that Genshin Impact and MiHoYo, they've leaked their own game. Naturally, I, I had to go check it out. Right? Naturally, I had to go check it out. I had to see what they meant by they've leaked their own game. So here we are on their official Twitter page. Um, and... Uh, what I'm about to show and see and yada yada, it's, it excites me. It actually excites me. They've leaked three new characters. They've leaked three new characters. They've gone ahead and leaked Yoimiya, who is a pyro bow user. They've, uh... They've gone ahead, they've, okay, they've showed Kazuha, who we know is coming in 1.6. They've gone and leaked my long-awaited Kamisato Ayaka. Really excited for that. And then a character that I've not seen before, who is Sayu. And she's Animo. So we're basically getting, within the next two updates... Two Animo characters. Two new Animo characters. I'm pretty sure that all of these characters are five stars. Um, we know Ayaka is going to be a five star character. We've seen, um, we've seen rumors and leaks of her from like way back when, like from before Dragon Spine days. We thought she was going to be the one in Dragon Spine. Then Albedo came out. Um, obviously we thought we were going to have, uh, Inazuma, like, by 1.5, 1.6, that didn't happen. We might be getting, so, so my theory behind this entire thing is that because they're leaking stuff now on their own, they're saying screw it to actual leakers. If we're going to leak things, we're going to have things leaked, we're going to do it ourselves. So are they actually, with these three characters, these Three new characters. Kamisato Ayaka. Uh, what was your name? Yoimiya. And Sayu. With these three characters. Are they confirming. Inazuma in 1.7. Um, obviously. They've just ruined their own game. For a month. They've ruined their own game. Because if we're getting. Three brand new characters. Within. One update. 
Do they really think people are going to be wishing on this Klee banner that's coming out in 1.6? Do they really think that people are going to be wishing for Klee? Do they really think people are going to be wishing for these crappy weapons? Granted, I might be wishing for this new bow just to see what it does. We are getting uh, a new um, uh, a new free weapon for Klee. We don't need to actually wish on here. For those of the free-to-play players and for those people who don't want another bow... They're not going to wish on this. In my opinion, Mihoyo just screwed themselves over. There's an entire month. Two banners. Two banners. They have uh, the Klee banner and then a Kazuha banner in this next update. And they've actually, I think, ruined their game for the next month. Because nobody, even the people that don't have Klee, even the people that was in the Kazuha waiting room, People are not going to wish on these characters. Maybe the whales, just for content. No, you're going to get Tectone and, and Tenha and other guys out there, uh, Exilize, whoever, wishing for these characters because it's content for them, right? They're whales. They are on the mission to collect every single character in the game. But for that's like a small percentage of the Genshin Impact players. For the majority of people, including myself, we're going to skip over 1.6. And they honestly just screwed themselves over. Because we're going to want this new Animo character. We're going to want... I know, like myself, there's many people who have been waiting for Ayaka for so long. They've been chanting Ayayas like everywhere. Every Discord community. Every stream. You know, there's a new bow character. Amber must be crying somewhere. Because she... The leaks on her are actually insane because someone did some more deep diving into her that sounded weird someone did more deep diving on her and found that she's very similar to Ganyu so all I'm saying is that 1.6 in the footage before you see this I say I'm looking forward to it yeah no I'm I'm good to skip over this update. I'm waiting for 1.7. As are many other people waiting for 1.7. I'm not the only one who's going to be saying this. I'm not the only one who's going to be saying that Mihoyo just screwed themselves for the next month. Mihoyo just screwed their banner wishings for the next month. No, there's probably other videos out there where people are saying it. I'm making this video extremely late. It's like 8 p.m. right now. That was released. When was this released? This was released uh, at 12. This was released at 12. So they are... I think they just ruined themselves. A lot of other content creators, a lot of other people will probably be saying the same thing. I personally am going to be waiting for 1.7. I'm not going to wish on the, uh, on the Klee banner. I might wish on the weapon banner to get the new bow to... To review it on stream, by the way, twitch.tv slash the gaming live. We're going to be looking at 1.6 when it comes out on the 9th, which is really soon. And uh, yeah, I just thought I'd show these, these three new characters that have been leaked, not by leakers, but by official MiHoYo themselves. Whether it was a mistake by MiHoYo, by someone on their social media page, whether it was someone going against their system, or whether it was on purpose. Mihoyo has screwed themselves for the next month. Mihoyo, I know I'm saying all this, but hey, uh, twitch.tv slash airgamingalive, hey, you want to sponsor me or anything uh, by any chance? I play Genshin a lot.